Hey, you. You're finally awake. You were trying to cross the border, right? Walked right into that Imperial ambush. Same as us. And that thief over there. Damn you Stormcloaks. Skyrim was fine until you came along. Empire was nice and lazy. But they hadn't been looking for you. Could have stolen that horse and been halfway to Hammerfell. You there. You and me. We shouldn't be here. It's the Stormcloaks the Empire wants. We're all brothers and sisters in vines now, thief. Shut up back there. What's wrong with him, huh? Watch your tongue. You're speaking to Ulfric Stormcloak, the true High King. Ulfric? The Jarl of Windhelm? You're the leader of the Rebellion. But if they've captured you... Oh, God. Where are they taking us? I don't know where we're going. But Sovngarde awaits. No, this can't be happening. This isn't happening. Hey. What village are you from, horse thief? Why do you care? A Nord's last thoughts should be of home. Rorikstead. I'm... I'm from Rorikstead. General Talia, sir. The headsman is waiting. Good. Let's get this over with. Sure. Mara, Debella, Kinnereff, Akatosh, Divines, please help me. Look at him. General Tully is the military governor. And it looks like the Dalmor are with him. Damn elves. I bet they had something to do with this. This is Helgen. I used to be sweet on a girl from here. Wonder if Vilod is still making that mead with juniper berries mixed in. Funny. When I was a boy, Imperial walls and towers used to make me feel so safe. Who are they, Daddy? Where are they going? We need to go inside with the pump. Why? I want to watch the soldiers. Inside the house. Now. Whoa. Yes, Papa. Get these prisoners out of the cart! Move it! Why are we stopping? Why do you think? End of the line. Let's go. Shouldn't keep the gods waiting for us. No, wait! We're not rebels! Face your death with some courage, thief. You've got to tell them! We weren't with you! This is a mistake! Step towards the block when we call your name. One at a time! <sighs> Empire loves their damn lists. Ulfric Stormcloak, Jarl of Windhelm. It has been an honor, Jarl Ulfric. Raylof of Riverwood. Lokir of Rorikstad. No! I'm not a rebel! You can't do this! Halt! You're not gonna kill me! Archers! Anyone else feel like running? Wait. You there. Step forward. Who are you?
You with one of the trade caravans, Khajiit? Your kind always seems to find trouble. Captain, what should we do? She's not on the list. Forget the list. She goes to the block. By your orders, Captain. I'm sorry. We'll make sure your remains are returned to elsewhere. Follow the captain, prisoner. Ulfric Stormcloak. Some here in Helgen call you a hero, but a hero doesn't use a power like the voice to murder his king and usurp his throne. You started this war, plunged Skyrim into chaos, and now the Empire is going to put you down and restore the peace. What was that? It's nothing. Carry on. Yes, General Tullius. Give them their last rites. As we commend your souls to Aetherius, blessings of the Eight Divines upon For the you. love of Talos, shut up and let's get this over with. As you wish. Come on! I haven't got all morning! My ancestors are smiling at me, Imperials. Can you say the same? As fearless in death as he was in life. Next, the cat! Here it is again. Did you hear that? I said, next prisoner. To the block, prisoner. Nice and easy. What do you see? It's in the clouds! Dragon! Don't get through! Guard, get the ground people! Are you coming? I can't see you! Come on! Come on! Come on! Come on! Come on! Come on! Legends don't burn down villages. We need to move now! Up through the tower. Let's go! Come on! Wait, 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 On the other side. Jump through the roof and keep going. Go! We'll follow when we can. Soldier! 
It's you and me, prisoner. Stay close. Hadvar, you're not stopping us this time. Fine, I hope that dragon takes you all to Sovereign Guard. With me, prisoner. Let's go. go fast. Quick, Come I on. can cut this way inside the keep. Die, dragon. We'll meet again in Sovereign Guard, brother. Looks like we're the only ones who made it. That thing was a dragon, no doubt. Just like the children's stories and the legends. The harbingers of the end times. We better get moving. Come here, let me see if I can get those bindings off. There you go. You may as well take Gunnar's gear. He won't be needing it anymore. That armor on Ganyar isn't doing him any good. Go ahead, take it. All right, get that armor on, and give that axe a few swings. I'm going to see if I can find some way out of here. Ah, this one's locked. Let's see about that gate. Damn, no way to open this from our side. Imperials, keep moving. Make cover. Get this gate open. Don't let those mice get away. out of here before the dragon brings the whole tower down on our heads. Damn, that dragon doesn't give up easy. Grab everything important and let's move. Dragon's burning everything to the... Uh, 
your room. See if you can find any potions. We'll need them. Done. Let's get moving. Troll's blood. It's a torture. Death to the Empire! Was Jarl Ulfric with you? No, I haven't seen him since the dragon showed up. Wait a second. Looks like there's something in this cage. Ah, it's locked. See if you can get it open with some picks. We might need that gold once we get out. Grab anything useful and let's go. Imperial dogs. There's nothing that's too here. low for them. I hope someone Sorry. knows where we're going. Orders are to wait until General Tullius arrives. I'm not waiting to be killed by a dragon. We need to pull back. Just give the general some time. Don't have a chance. Ah! 
Let's go on ahead. See if the way is clear. Let's see where this goes. Find another way out. Doesn't go anywhere. Guess we better try this way. those damn things. Too many eyes, you know? See her? I'd rather not tangle with her right now. Let's try to sneak by. Just take it nice and slow. And watch where you step. Or if you're feeling lucky, you can take this bow. Might take her by surprise. Go ahead. I'll follow your lead and watch your back. Sneaking is overrated, eh?
like the way out. I knew we'd make it. Wait! There he goes. Looks like he's gone for good this time. No way to know if anyone else made it out alive. But this place is going to be swarming with Imperials soon enough. We'd better clear out of here. My sister, Gerder, runs the mill in Riverwood, just up the road. I'm sure she'd help you out. It's probably best if we split up. Good luck. I wouldn't have made it without your help today. You know, you should go to Windhelm and join the fight to free Skyrim. You've seen the true face of the Empire here today. If anyone will know what the coming of the dragon means, it's Ulf. See that ruin up there? Bleak Falls Barrow. I never understood how my sister could stand living in the shadow of that place. I guess you get used to it. These are the Guardian Stones, three of the thirteen ancient standing stones that dot Skyrim's landscape. Go ahead, see for yourself. Warrior, good. Those stars will guide you to honor and glory. Remember, this isn't Stormcloak territory. If we're ahead of the news from Helgen, we should be fine. As long as we don't do anything stupid. If we run into any Imperials, just let me do the talking, alright? Glad you decided to come with me. We're almost to Riverwood. Like nobody here knows what happened yet. Come on. A dragon! Gerd is probably a working at her lumber what? mill. What is it now, Mother? Ian was as big as the mountain and black as night. It flew right over the barrel. Dragons. 
Gerda. Brother, Mara's mercy, it's good to see you. But is it safe for you to be here? Gerda. We heard that Ulfric had been captured. Gerda, I'm fine. At least now I am. Are you hurt? What's happened? And who is this? One of your comrades? Not a comrade yet, but a friend. I owe her my life, in fact. Is there somewhere we can talk? There's no telling when the news from Helgen will reach the Imperials. Helgen? Has something happened? You're right. Follow me. Hod, come here a minute. I need your help with something. Hod, just come here. Raylon, what are you doing here? Huh. I'll be right down. Uncle Rayla, can I see your axe? How many Imperials have you killed? Do you really know Ulfric Stormcloak? Hush, Frodnar. This is no time for your games. Go and watch the south road. Come find us if you see any Imperial soldiers coming. Aw, Mama. I want to stay and talk with Uncle Rayla. Look at you. Almost a grown man. Won't be long before you'll be joining the fight yourself. That's right. Don't worry, Uncle Rayla. I won't let those soldiers sneak up on you. Now, Rayla, what's going on? You two look pretty well done in. <sighs> I can't remember when I last slept. Ooh, where to start? Well, the news you heard about Ulfric was true. The Imperials ambushed us outside Darkwater Crossing. Like they knew exactly where we'd be. That was... Uh, two days ago now. We stopped in Helgen this morning, and I thought it was all over. Had us lined up to the headsman's block and ready to start chopping. The cowards! They wouldn't dare give Ulfric a fair trial. Treason for fighting for your own people. All of Skyrim would have seen the truth then. But then, out of nowhere, a dragon attacked. You don't mean a real, live... I can hardly believe it myself. And I was there. As strange as it sounds, we'd be dead if not for that dragon. In the confusion, we managed to slip away. Are we really the first to make it to Riverwood? Nobody else has come up the south road today, as far as I know. Good. Maybe we can lay up for a while. I hate to put your family in danger, Gerda, but... Nonsense. You and your friend are welcome to stay here as long as you need to. Let me worry about the Imperials. Any friend of Raylov's is a friend of mine. Here's the key to the house. Stay as long as you like. If there is anything else you need, just let me know. There is something you could do for me. For all of us here. The Jarl needs to know if there's a dragon on the loose. Riverwood is defenseless. We need to get word to Jarl Balgruf in Whiterun to send whatever troops he can. If you'll do that for me, I'll be in your debt. Thanks, sister. I knew we could count on you. I ought to get back to work before I missed, but... Did anyone else escape? Did Ulfric? Don't worry. I'm sure he made it out. It'll take more than a dragon to stop Alfred Stormcloak. I'll let them into the house and, you know, show them where everything is. Hmm. Help them drink up our mead, you mean? Good luck, brother. I'll see you later. Don't worry about me. I know how to lay low. I told you my sister would help us out.
I trust you're not planning any trouble. What can I do for you, friend? So you saw a dragon, did you? Tell me, what was it like? As big as a house? Don't even say such things! I hope that dragon stays away from Riverwood. We don't need that kind of trouble. Here for work? Get now. I've got enough to worry about, taking care of my family. I don't concern myself with such matters. Until next time. I hope to see you in Windhelm. Good luck. I'm glad to help any way I can. Lucan over in the Riverwood Trader says thieves broke into his store. Strange. He says they hardly took anything. It's my mill. Some folks think it's my town too, but it ain't. The Jarl in Whiterun owns the land and the town. I just pay the taxes. The Empire may have been good for Skyrim once upon a time, but those days are long past. Banning the worship of Talos was the last straw. Thalmor everywhere, dragging people off for honoring our own gods. I'm glad Raelof is helping drive them out of here. If I was a bit younger, I might have joined the fight myself. Jarl Balgruf? I don't mean to be disrespectful as he's ruled White Run hold well for years, but he seems in over his head now. He's been trying to stay out of the war, but it can't last. He's going to have to pick a side. I'm afraid he's going to make the wrong choice. I wouldn't say that. But he and Ulfric have been at odds for years, and I'm afraid Balgruf will end up siding with the Empire because of it. But it's hard to believe that even Balgruf would choose Elisif over Ulfric. I suppose she's Jarl Elisif now. She married High King Turug just before Ulfric killed him. The Empire supports her claim to be High Queen. I don't really have anything against her. Not her fault that her husband Turug was bought and paid for by the Empire. But she's nothing but a puppet for the Empire now, with her husband Turug dead. Ulfric will make sure she never takes the throne as High Queen. Some say murdered, but it was a lawful challenge in the old way. Ulfric called him out as a traitor to Skyrim and killed him in single combat. If Tori couldn't defend his throne, he had no business being High King. No, not until the Moot meets to choose another, and it won't meet until one side or the other wins the war. Don't worry, though. Ulfric is a rightful High King. He'll drive out the Empire, and Skyrim will have peace at last. Cross the river and then head north. You'll see Whiterun on its hill as you pass the falls. And by supplies, I suppose you mean weapons and armor? Alvor can help you out. He's our blacksmith.
Aye. I hope to see you in Windhelm. Good luck. May the gods watch over your battles, friend. Seriously? You don't know? That was Ulfric Stormcloak himself. Oh, right. They said you were captured crossing the border. Still, I'm surprised you haven't heard of Ulfric. He's our leader. The leader of the Stormcloaks. I was assigned to Ulfric's guard. We were on our way to Darkwater Crossing in the south of Eastmarch. The Imperials were waiting for us. As pretty an ambush as I ever saw. We were outnumbered five to one at least. Ulfric ordered us to stop fighting. Didn't want us all to die for nothing, I guess. I thought they were taking us south to Cyrodiil. Parade us in front of the Emperor. But then, we stopped in Helgen. And you know the rest. I'm going to rest up here a while before heading to Windhelm. Be careful. We'll show those faithless dogs who this land belongs to. Damn right. You don't have to be a Nord to fight for Skyrim's freedom. You should come to Windhelm with me and join the fight to free Skyrim. You've seen the true face of the Empire here today. If anyone will know what the coming of the dragon means, it's Ulfric. Well, maybe not. Dragons haven't been seen in Skyrim for an age or more. But wherever that dragon came from, and whatever it wants, Ulfric will get to the bottom of it. You can count on that. Besides, you have your own score to settle with the Empire now. And with that dragon. Yeah, sure, I understand. No need to decide now. But I know that after you think about what you saw today, you'll realize that Skyrim deserves to be free. Whatever you need. Buy your smear if it's simple and strong. I can forge it. I see no harm in it, if you have the skill. The grindstone will improve your weapons. Use the table to improve your armor. If you've got the raw materials, you can use the forge to make something new. Yes, actually. How about you smith me an iron dagger? Here's everything you need to make one. Go ahead. Mm-hmm. Not bad. Reminds me when I first started Smith. Not bad, but it's a little dull. How about you sharpen it up? Just need a bit of metal and the grindstone over there. Until next time. You the sneak? This looks good. You put time into your blades. They'll serve you well when you need them. You want to keep helping? How about you make some armor? 
Let's start by tanning some leather on the rack. Aye. Aye. Ah, good. A lot of weapons and armor need leather for straps, fittings, that kind of thing. Let's see if you can make a hide helmet. Here's the rest of what you need. All right, then. Some? Huh. I should hire you to be my assistant at this rate. Let's improve the fit. Take this leather to the workbench over there. All right, then. You, you have talent. Keep working at your craft. And you'll be a fine smith one day. Why don't you keep that dagger and helmet? Maybe you'll remember me when you're making Skyforge steel, huh? The finest weapons and armor. Until next time. <clears throat> I could... Hmm... Blades, helmets... Pretty much anything to suit your needs. Good day. You the sneaky type? Got some nice daggers around here somewhere. Yes?
Yeah. Out of my way, stranger. Orgnar. Orgnar, are you listening? Hard not to. The ale is going bad. We need to get a new batch. Did you hear me? Yep, ale's going bad. I guess you don't have potatoes in your ears after all. Just make sure we get a fresh batch in soon. You're that visitor been poking around. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. We got rooms and food. Drink, too. I cook. Ain't much else to tell. I'm the innkeeper. It's my business to keep track of strangers. We don't get a lot of travelers here in Riverwood. We drink to our youth, to days come and gone. For the age. of kings on the day of your death we will drink and we'll sing With the, the war keeps most folks away these fight days fight all our lives and when sovereign guard beckons every one of us dies but this land
Some come to buy, but others come to steal. Khajiit are not welcome in the cities, so we make our camps outside the walls. They'll never see you coming. May your road lead you to warm sands. Khajiit, the warm sand of elsewhere is far away from here. Please, come and browse our goods. Need something? An astute question, for we are far from home. And this is a cold, hard land. The wise trader finds the best opportunities, even if he must travel far to find them. Skyrim is a ripe opportunity indeed. The dragons and the war have scared many other traders away, but for those with courage, there is much profit to be made. Take a look. It is all in this note. I hope that you will come to do business with us again. Halt! City's closed with the dragons about. Official business only. Fine. But we'll be keeping an eye on you. whatever it takes, but we must have more swords for the Imperial soldiers. I just can't fill an order that size on my own. Why don't you swallow that stubborn pride of yours and ask Yorland Greymane for help? <laughs> I'd sooner bend my knee to Ulfric's Stormcloak. Besides, Greymane would never make steel for the Legion. Have it your way. I'll take the job, but don't expect a miracle. Born. 
Lauren, give me your money. I... I don't have any money. You better give me five septums right now. Ten septums tomorrow, baby. Boys, no, please. girls, dogs, I really, It's elders, no fun getting pushed around all the time. Bye. I know your family's honor is important to you, but we can't afford it. It took me weeks to find that thieves' den. I can't stop now, and I can't get the sword on my own. So you're willing to starve your wife and daughter to reclaim some rusty old sword? I just need to hire one, maybe two good men. You won't starve. I'll put it plainly. You can claim your sword, or you can keep your wife. If you set foot outside that gate, I won't be here when you return. Safir! Wait, I... Sometimes I miss the soldier's life, but when I hold my daughter in my arms, I know I made the right choice. No, I'm not. Looks like we've got something in common, then. My wife's a good woman. She can be a little hard-headed sometimes, but I love her just the same. My sapphire doesn't like that I've been spending so much time looking for my father's old sword. He fed his entire family with the gold he made using that weapon. I'm not about to let it gather dust in some thief's trophy room. I tracked it to a group of bandits nearby. But I'm no fool. I'd need the White Run guards or maybe hire the companions to get it. I don't know why I'm saying this, but if you find it out in your travels, I'd be grateful to you. If you find that sword, please bring it to me. They say Helgen got hit by a dragon. One of those horrors comes here. We'll be ready. Ulfred, patron of the great clan Battleborn. My lord, please. This is no time for rash action. I just think we need more information before we act. I just... Who's this, then? What's the meaning of this interruption? Jarl Balgruf is not receiving visitors. As House Karl, my job is to deal with all dangers that threaten the Jarl or his people. So you have my attention. Now explain yourself. Whatever you have to say to the Jarl, you can say to me. It's I'm starting right, to think... I want to hear what she has to say. What's this about Riverwood being in danger? Gerda owns the lumber mill, if I'm not mistaken. Pillar of the community, not prone to flights of fancy. And you're sure Helgen was destroyed by a dragon? This wasn't some Stormcloak raid gone wrong? By Ismir, Irileth was right! What do you say now, Proventus? Shall we continue to trust in the strength of our walls against the dragon? My lord, we should send troops to Riverwood at once. It's in the most immediate danger. If the Jarl of Falkreath will view that as a provocation. He'll assume we're preparing to join Ulfric's side and attack him. We should Enough. not- Enough! I'll not stand idly by while the dragon burns my hold and slaughters my people. Irileth, send a detachment to Riverwood at once. Yes, my Jarl. If you'll excuse me, I'll return to my duties. That would be best. Well done. You sought me out on your own initiative. You've done Whiterun a service, and I won't forget it. Here, take this as a small token of my esteem. There is another thing you could do for me. Suitable for someone of your particular talents, perhaps. 
Come, let's go find Faringar, my court wizard. He's been looking into a matter related to these dragons and rumors of dragons. I'm so angry, I can hardly stand it. Father promised me a new dress days ago. Now where is it? Brigands I can handle, but this talk of dragons? World's gone mad, I say. Faringar, I think I've found someone who can help you with your dragon project. Go ahead and fill her in with all the details. So the Earl thinks you can be of use to me? Oh yes, he must be referring to my research into the dragons. Yes, I could use someone to fetch something for me. Well, when I say fetch, I really mean delve into a dangerous ruin in search of an ancient stone tablet that may or may not actually be there. Ah, no mere brute mercenary, but a thinker. Perhaps even a scholar? You see, when the stories of dragons began to circulate, many dismissed them as mere fantasies, rumors, impossibilities. One sure mark of a fool is to dismiss anything that falls outside his experience as being impossible. But I began to search for information about dragons. Where had they gone all those years ago? And where were they coming from? I, uh, learned of a certain stone tablet said to be housed in Bleak Falls Barrow. A dragon stone, said to contain a map of dragon burial sites. Go to Bleak Falls Barrow, find this tablet, no doubt interred in the main chamber, and bring it to me. Simplicity itself. An old tomb built by the ancient Nords, perhaps dating back to the Dragon War itself. Ah, maybe you just want to know how to get there. It's near Riverwood, a miserable little village a few miles south of here. I'm sure some of the locals can point you in the right direction once you get there. Well, must preserve some professional secrets, mustn't we? I have my sources. Reliable sources. This is a priority now. With you. The Anything we can use to fight man. this dragon, Neither or dragons. We need it quickly, before it's too late. Of course, Jarl Balgruf. You seem to have found me an able assistant. I'm sure she will prove most useful. Succeed at this, and you'll be rewarded. White Run will be in your debt. Oh, I thought you were already on your way to Bleak Falls Barrow. Let Alvar hear you talking to me that way. He'll stick your head in his forge. So that's a no, I take it? 